Hi everyone, it's Sue and welcome back to Discovering the Art of Living. Now if you're new to my channel, click on the subscribe button below as well as the bell icon to be notified when I upload new content. So today is the first Wednesday of June, so that's Wacky Wednesday! So if you're new to my channel and you're like, what the heck is Wacky Wednesday? It's where you, the subscribers, suggest to me three totally unrelated items, they don't even have to be arts and crafts items, that I have to put together to make a beautiful, functional home decor piece, just to see if I can do it. So this month's challenge items were suggested by Country Lily DIY Decor. So if you wouldn't mind checking out her channel, I'll also put a link in the description box below, that would be awesome. So she suggested a glass or cup, cotton balls, and nail polish. Yikes. So if you're ready to see what I came up with, let's get started. So the boys had a set of Star Wars glasses and the picture was really rubbing off of this one so I decided to finish it off. Used a little SOS pad, some hot water, and most of it scraped right off no problem. I also found these cotton balls and some nail polish and I thought I'd add with it. I had some lilacs that I had brought in from the house and the blossoms had died so I thought I could reuse the stems. I'm also going to be using a bit of painter's tape, a glue gun and glue, and a few petals of some Dollar Tree flowers. So first step was to take my painter's tape and apply it around the glass to make some geometric designs. I had the idea to use the nail polish to paint on the glass and make a cute vase. Once I had the design in place, I decided to use two or three different colors of nail polish to paint into the design. Now it did end up taking about three coats to completely cover these designs and I would definitely suggest opening a window as the fumes were quite strong. polish was drying I decided to make some cute little cotton blossoms to put in my vase for spring. So I took a few of the petals off these Dollar Tree flowers, took out the little green plastic centers, then I used some brown acrylic paint to paint them to look like the little bottoms of the cotton blossoms. Then I let them dry. Once the petals were dry, I used some glue and a glue gun to attach them to the bottom of my cotton balls and I fluffed the cotton balls out a little bit so they would look more natural. Then I glued these in place on the sticks or the branches from the lilacs as desired.
once all the cotton balls were in place, I put them in my vase and I thought they turned out really cute. I really wanted to have the glass show up though, so I ended up using some of my little fairy lights again and putting them inside the vase first, then putting the cotton blossoms inside just to give it a little prettier farmhouse look. Hope you enjoyed this video and see you next time on Discovering the Art of Living.